So I've been using Vegas as my primary video editor for some time now. And I know what some of you may be saying. Why? A lot of people hate on Vegas. They say it's not very good. They say there's better, more professional softwares out there. They say, you know, there's not a whole lot of features. But in my opinion, I mean, I love Vegas. I've been using it since like version 13 or 14. And I used to use it back in the day when Sony owned it. I think it's the most stable, intuitive software out there when it comes to editing videos. I don't have a whole lot of issues with it. I like the way that it's set up. They're constantly improving it with every single iteration, which is all you can really ask for. And sure, it has its, you know, slew of problems. You used to have to convert it from studio RGB to screen RGB. Otherwise, your videos would save darker, which was a pretty big issue. But they finally addressed that. And they're addressing other issues, like they're supporting more and more file types. I mean, that's all you can ask for. And honestly, I just love the software. But the biggest issue that I've had the bane of its existence, in my personal opinion, is trying to use this very feature right here. Video preview on external monitor. Something that should work without a single problem has had so many issues throughout my career. I just, it's even hard to describe. Trying to figure out why it does what it does, trying to figure out how to fix it with every single new version. It's crazy. Because back in the day, all you had to do was go into options, go down to preferences, and turn off GPU acceleration. Instead of using my 1080, just turn that off. Boom, restart the software, and then boom, I can hit this all day long. No problems. Stop I can play it. Ever since no problems. However, in the newer versions, I think in version 17 or 18, I can't really remember, that didn't fix it. For whatever reason, this no longer fixes it. I never really understood what it did in the first place, but okay, that's fine. They upgraded their decoder, and it now uses NVIDIA NVENC instead of, like, the built-in whatever, whatever. So you have to use Enable Legacy AVC and enable legacy HEVC, and make sure that your hardware decoder is on off for NVIDIA NVENC. As soon as you do that, restart the software, it works fine. Okay, but there's an issue with it. I can no longer export as NVENC. If I have the NVENC decoder off, I can't use it. I mean, I got Intel QSV here. I don't understand why, because I have no Intel parts in my computer. It's AMD and NVIDIA, but you know, whatever. That's the only thing it offers me, which is a bummer, but okay. At least I can preview over to my other monitor. But now if I go over to version 19, you'd think it would work the same way. But it doesn't. I go over to preferences. I have GPU off. And then I go over to file I.O. I have both of these checked off. But for whatever reason, when I go to render, it still shows NVENC as an option. Which I want. I do want to have that as an option. Because that's the version that I would use. It's going to use my GPU to render quickly. And, you know, I mean, that's exactly what I want. But that tells me that's not saving the settings. So when I go to click this button, I mean, I can Stop play the video. It works fine here. UFC but as soon as I click this, all I see on my other monitor is a black screen. And now if I go contract. back over here, you you're going to see everything runs like crap. Super laggy. Not very responsive. So if I go back over the full screen and I click on it and try to hit escape to close out of the full screen, which is what you do, I get a little spinny thing. And then it locks up and says Vegas Pro is not responding. Then I have to close the program and it crashes. This is a problem that I used to face back in the day. And like I said, after a whole bunch of experimenting and doing research online, I was able to figure out solutions to fix it. But for some reason with version 19, it's not working no matter what I do. So this made me do even more investigation. I wanted to figure out once and for all... Why is this happening and why would my specific setup do I have this issue in the first place? Because I watch a lot of people on YouTube, a lot of their tutorials and stuff, and they don't have this issue. A lot of people actually recommend to leave GPU acceleration on and they don't have to do any of these funky settings to get their stuff to work beautifully. So why in my situation have I always had to use some weird workaround in order to get my preview to work? Because this is a very important feature. If you're editing video, you want to be able to see your video full screen, especially if you got multiple monitors, you want to utilize them, right? It doesn't make any sense not to. So this is a very important feature, but for some reason, it's been so botched since the very beginning of like Vegas's existence. So I started investigating. My monitor setup is a dual setup. I have one monitor on my left, which is an LG IPS panel, which has decent colors. This is a monitor I like to use for my full screen so I can make sure everything is, you know, color accurate. My right monitor is my BenQ gaming monitor. It's 144 hertz, but the colors on it are kind of booty. 
So I use this monitor for my editing. This is my main monitor. It's straight on with me. So I use it as my primary. It has all my desktop icons, my windows open up here. It's just the way that I like it. That's how my workflow is. But for some reason, it seems like either NVIDIA doesn't allow NVENC to work on your secondary monitor, or there's just something internally wrong with Vegas that causes these crashes. And I really want to know if anybody has any idea how to fix this. Am I on to something with this? You know, this idea, because if I switch over my primary to my left monitor, I am now able to preview over to my left monitor without any issues. Or if I was to take this specific window and I was to drag this over to my other monitor and then go into the settings and then go down to preview and I was to change this from monitor one to two to this monitor, I can preview over to this monitor without problems. But I cannot preview over to my secondary monitor without it causing it to crash. Doesn't matter what I do. I can turn off GPU here. I tried a bunch of different things. It doesn't work. So am I right saying that NVIDIA doesn't allow NVENC on a secondary monitor? Or is there something actually wrong with Vegas? I love to know. I want to use version 19 very badly, but I'm not able to currently. And honestly, I want to be able to use my NVENC for decoding. I want to be able to import 10-bit videos, which are some of the side effects that you can't do when you're using those legacy settings. And I don't want to have to change over my setup and have my primary on the left because that's just going to screw up everything. I know it's kind of like I want my cake and they eat it too, but the computer should work for me. I shouldn't have to work for it. There's no reason why this shouldn't be working. I'm not asking for much. So I really hope that somebody out there has a solution for this because, like I said, it's driving me up the wall and I've been dealing with it for years. It's just now I don't even have a solution to fix it and I'm forced to use an older version because of it. And I'm just, I'm just not going to accept that. I mean, it's, it's almost to the point where I'm going to say screw Vegas and I'm going to go elsewhere because a feature that's this, you know, simple should not have these issues.